Hi there guys, good morning from Dhaka, Bangladesh, checking the mic, my check is good, time is around 2.30am uh, here and I'm doing a couple of videos for you, one is list, done already and this is the second episode where I'm going to review a house from India and I'm picking up these fragrances suddenly, you know, if you go to a mall, you check out fragrances, you see something looks interesting, good bargain, something good fun, you know, uh, I worthwhile to create content, I pick up these fragrances once in a while like fog, Sometimes I did Wildstone. I did many budget fragrance houses, which I'm very proud of. And fun fact is, when you do review budget fragrances, it gets a lot of view. Okay, that's one of the main reasons why I do videos, because it helps me get views. And also in return, people are looking, you know, on budget, trying to look for a decent fragrance cologne for their collection. Uh, it helps them. Not everybody can afford a $100 or $50 fragrance, especially students or people who just join the job or doing like, you know, going through some uh, rough patches for them these are kind of good fragrances so the fragrance house i'm going to talk about is called real man i think i have two fragrances i'll put uh, up the photo and these are uh, 100 ml edp and this is real man pure cologne this is the first one i'm going to review and the house is called real man and other ones called it pure neroli initially i saw this on a website and i wanted to test them before buying them these are around uh, 700 to 900 rupees in india which translates to maybe 150 dollars sorry 150 000, sorry 15 dollars so sorry my bad 15 dollars in usa uh, currency and our currency wise it's with the vat and tax you pay like 130 140 you know sorry sorry so bad uh 1400 taka okay like 1300 1400 taka so 115 dollars budget very affordable 100 ml if the juice is kind of decent it's really worthwhile isn't it so i will start with uh couple of fragrances uh, before i start the review i'll show you they have few more fragrances i did not pick because i did not want to spend all that money so they have this whole collection okay there's a blue one there's a green one there is a red one uh, this is not picking up okay and then they also have these two so they have i think five or six in the line if i try them other ones once again if i like i'll review okay so some of you wanted to see my review and people in bangladesh india especially very excited so i'll start with this one the yellow one very nice coloration eye-catching presentation and in their ad they said these are made for indian weathers particularly warm weathers you know like day-to-day uh, -day life and to suit you know like this weather they made this line interesting we'll see and uh, it's called pure cologne okay really nice it looks like lemon right lemon color but in here it's looking more like a gold sort of like a yellow that color this is how the box looks you can take a look I have sprayed at the back the perfume just to sniff it i tried on my skin as well but today i'm wearing something else so here's the price mentioned in rupees some other detailing that's how the box looks nothing crazy going on here but it's well done box i like the color it's eye-catching moment you see from far you know it's a perfume box and then here's the bottle really beautiful bottles okay um maybe to some it may look like shower uh, you know shower gel sort of plastic container but these are glass okay at the back some information the price and expiry date the name of the perfume real man and edp concentration the cap these bottles remind me a little bit of wildstone perfumes but these are better a built better quality but one thing is cheap of course you expect some cheapness from a cheap uh, or affordable line is this cap okay if i show you the cap you can tell these are like i'm not even scared to play with them if put a little bit pressure they can be broken yeah, you know it's not really good quality it's just uh, plastic okay right <laughs> so the atomizer also a little bit cheap feeling you can see there's a gap in between the sprayer and the uh, you know the cover whatever you call the neck uh, this could have been covered i thought i could cover it but when i spray it if i let it go it goes back to this but it makes up with this prayer check out this prayer okay huge mist huge you can spray a little bit also okay very good spare this prayer is 10 okay so i forgive for the cap and all that so this one it's not fit <coughs> strong <laughs> and uh, i think the bottle has decent weight to it so let's talk about this when i sprayed this i knew this is familiar to me but i still couldn't think of what am i smelling because when you hear the name pure cologne you expect something like a what new dior sauvage or Durham sport perhaps lemon lime right it's not like that it's very familiar yet you cannot instantly remember the name so i wore it uh, both these fragrances and i got performance wise okay unbelievable performance okay 
longevity from this i expected not more than one to two hours it lasted only five and a half hours on my skin i could still detect it but it was like this much you know like this much uh, sierge or projection after that but a fragrance that lasts five hours i'm very happy even four hours i would be happy so it's it passes the test of performance and i think the projection is about 45 to one hour 45 minutes to one hour which is decent so when i was talking about the smell i could not think of what i'm smelling and if you ask me about the notes i don't have the notes breakdown but it smells so good it smells sexy it smells formal it smells a little bit middle eastern and on the dry down i think this one has huge ambroxan note in there it reminds me of this perfume which is very expensive by uh, arabian oud called amiri if you like this fragrance they are similar vibes okay perhaps this is cloned to something else as well but i got a vibe of middle eastern shake from this okay so this is not a rose oud combo and it's fresh <laughs> okay and i think it's a uh, kind of like amber uh, uh, not woody but raisinous a little bit and it's uh, kind of remind me of something very expensive like a luxury fragrance house okay that's what this quality smells like and the thing is the dry down is very much uh, similar to kind of like amiri uh, or you can say what's the other one uh the blue one and i forgot amiri sultani right or sultan i forgot one of those so it's not a straight up clone of those okay if you're looking for a straight up clone i uh, don't get this but if you like those kind of fragrance vibes and you just want a good performing version which is on budget you can try it so real man pure cologne really really beautiful the dry down especially very sexy this one my rating on this would be eight out of ten for the price very good so the next one yeah it's on the box still maybe there's cardamom i don't know i don't know but there's mild spices in there which makes very sexy it's like mm, good stuff okay uh, let it dry down it will be good <clears throat> next one i saw i saw the name i saw it on one of the pages called daraj or daraj okay and they are giving a little bit of discount <coughs> It's like one dollar off or something like that so you know i don't want to blind by anything <laughs> i can go to a mall i can try these and then you know i pay one dollar more but i know what i'm buying i don't want to blind by these so the name was real man pure neroli and you guys know i have a soft spot for that note which is op opposite to my friend <laughs> thomas <laughs> he knows he will see this and he'll laugh he'll chuckle so this is the green box i like the color it matches the neroli sort of vibe you know neroli heavy mugler cologne beautiful perfume and there are many other fragrances that has neroli it was not fitting in there anyway so i saw this basically this is what i tried first and i knew i was gonna like it but i was not sure how's the quality quality okay this is the bottle exact same size exact same uh design just the coloration is different this is kind of like what green is this you can is it jade forgot the green <coughs> beautiful color looks like a stone or a piece of a gemstone okay looks nice take a look it looks like kryptonite okay no not really so the cap again cheap feeling you can play with it you don't feel you don't want to do it with the bottle by the way but again the cap it's it's all the caps i think right sprayer i'm <coughs> sorry little bit like this beautiful mist okay so these prayers i think some of the best prayers let me check yeah sorry someone was sending me uh some message so i was like okay at this late night nobody messages so like normal message anyway so this fragrance if you love neroli if you love irish spring soap if you like anything that has neroli in it 4711 cologne a tom ford neroli portofino and my favorite being this discontinued gem called ferraris bright neroli this is my most favorite because i don't know i fell in love with from the day one I got this like early part of my journey 2018 or something i went a long way to collect it and trust me man this is a treasured item for me okay even though uh, this is not the most expensive nearly fragrance that i have i did review i think portfolio or something like that from our uh al Haramein. that was the longest lasting nearly and most expensive this one you thought when you got it back in the days was budget right this is even more budget okay why because this is 15 dollars let's say 15 could be 13 could be 12 depends right so let's say under 15 dollars you get this how good is this it smells so good so so nice okay so let's talk about the negative side a little bit because everything is nothing nothing is perfect the negative if i have to criticize first thing it smells a little bit 
synthetic cheap okay it smells like a soap which you wash your clothes with something not not necessarily want to put on yourself okay and that is a criticism i'll give it to this one uh, instead let's say you say house 4711 cologne that is a better quality even though it doesn't last as much as this one this has fantastic longevity four to five hours once again on me in high heat so you can tell this one is very nice but that one criticism i would give it it smells synthetic in the opening so when you spray right up do not smell like this okay it will go straight up all the way here and you will have a headache and nasty sort of vibe so you may say why should i buy it then you don't have to okay but there are people who like to smell like whereas bright neroli tom ford neroli portofino i do have one of those blue ones and right there porto neroli from that mason alhambra line that's even more expensive than this that one is ten dollars more expensive or twelve dollars more than this that's why i'm reviewing this so once you can let go of that initial stage how you gonna do it spray on the shirt do not spray on the skin or do not smell initially spray here away from your nose <coughs> do not spray behind your ears okay or spray here okay and then back okay spray heavily on the shirt hang it and then wear it after five to ten minutes then you love it this one becomes beautiful ice spring soap on the dry down it smells very much like very bright and early but i'll tell you the quality and this is way superior if you can afford this get this if you can afford that and if you can afford 4711 cologne but don't like the performance get this this is the best in terms of price point the best deal you can get amazing beautiful i like it more than this actually it's like i gave it eight i'll give this one like a nine for budget perfume overall these are like if you ask me to rate overall in my whole collection perhaps they'll get like a 6.5 and this will get like a seven okay but for the price i'm putting eight and this is 8.5 okay let's give you 8.5 okay Bo both very good fragrances for the price check them out go spray them in the shopping mall and see how it works for you do not blind buy and then you know blame others i'm just reviewing so people can know about a new uh, brand okay it's not a new brand but first time i'm reviewing on my channel so i think money well spent so uh, hopefully uh, you will try them and i would like to try the rest of the if i can i'll review thanks so much for watching and uh, well done india all right uh, they're doing a lot of good modern fragrances uh, i would like to review this house called what is that house titan titan fragrances i want to try they have some really really good popular ones in there but they just don't bring it here if i do i'll review take care take care take care take care take care and you have a very nice day see you soon bye bye